Hey, this is Isaac from QuickKey, and today I wanted to show you a little video because we've recently upgraded our scanning software for Android devices, and we've been getting some questions. What are the minimum hardware requirements for using the QuickKey mobile grading app with an Android device? So today I want to show you um, just how little it costs to get a device that is capable of instantly scanning uh, paper quizzes and tests uh, using the QuickKey mobile grading app. Today I'm going to be using an LG Phoenix 2 uh, Android track phone. This phone costs $50 in Best Buy uh, on uh, August 22nd of 2016. It has 720p video. And uh, well, here we go. I'm going to make up my test, choose the answer key. Um, I'll choose which course I want to scan. And then uh, today I'm going to be showing you scanning with the uh, Quick Keys free, printable, and photocopyable 30 question bubble sheet. All right, here we go. So you see those two little white dots? I tap the screen to focus the video. And now the app is starting to scan and it's giving me an instant score report. Now, these, uh, each of these sheets should be scoring alternately with a 100% and then a 93%. And that's how we know that it's correct. Uh, these are all marked with pencil. And I'm just gonna roll through a few of these. This is real time, so you can see how long it takes to scan. You'll notice I'm lining up the bubble sheet bounding box with the green brackets and every once in a while I'm tapping the screen to focus the camera. This is critical with Android devices, especially the lower powered entry level ones that don't have great autofocus when they're in video mode. And that's an important thing to note here about QuickKey. QuickKey pulls the scanned images from a video. You don't need to press any buttons to scan with QuickKey. All right, there you go. So you can see it's pretty straightforward scanning with QuickKey, um, even with an entry level Android device. All you need to do is make sure you focus the camera, line up the bubble sheet with the green brackets on the screen, and then be patient. For a lot of people, um, their very first scan might take them 20 to 30 seconds before they get a feel for it. It's a lot like riding a bike, but pretty soon you'll be scanning each sheet in, you know, one, two, three seconds or less. Thanks a lot.